PTSD is not the same for a veteran as it is for someone who's been incarcerated, and we still call it everything. So what the field of social work could do is differentiate the kind of PTSD um, a child from uh, a school that's been shot at is different from a veteran, is different from a homeless person, is different from prison. Because all four have different triggers, but we junk them up together, and we and it's very specific and very clear to me what formerly incarcerated people need from social workers. But I don't think they know, not because they're not interested, but because they just don't know. We've not created a place for this, and I think it's urgent that we do, given that 700,000 people come out, and also, even more importantly. There is so much pressure to release incarcerated people right now. For, like people who are incarcerated for a lifetime for marijuana. Elderly people, there's moves in at least 20 states to release anybody over the age of 60. So you are facing, um, so these people who are completely unprepared to come back into society, particularly if you're an elderly person, that's a whole separate subject. Elderly, formerly incarcerated people have complete, they're completely different needs. They have serious medical needs because they've never been dealt with for the 20 or 30 years they've been in prison. Um, they have serious dental needs because in prison, if you have a pain, uh, the only option you have is to live with the pain or have your tooth pulled with no Novocaine. So people who've been in prison 20 or 30 years have bodies that are 20 years older, that have accelerated aging, and they have severe mental health, sorry, mental health issues. So there is an area of study that we're behind on, and that I really can't encourage, can't, I want to encourage everybody, because it's a big enough field so that it should be a field in and of itself. It should be a division within social work to deal with people who come out of prison or immigrants who've been coming out of detention, or people who are coming out of jails like Rikers. That's a field of study. That's not just one research project.